Good morning, Cupcakes. It is a beautiful morning here in Zephyrtown. I hope your day is going wonderfully. For today's episode, well, first of all, we've got a golden egg, which is nice. Always nice. Uh, but primarily, what we want to do this episode is to do with the bazaar. In fact, this entire episode probably is going to revolve around the bazaar. Specifically, the first spring bazaar of year three. And what that means is that we will be able to acquire silkies, silky chickens, Suffolk sheep, and Jersey cows. They produce good wool, uh, black eggs, and good milk. I think it's ca just called good, good milk. It might be called Jersey milk, but anyway. Those are uh, basically upgraded versions of the of the food that, of the stuff that you get from, from cows and sheep and chickens normally. And, uh, yeah, so we, that was the entire reason, by the way, why we only had five cows, five sheep, and ten chickens. Even though this barn can hold twenty chickens and twenty either cows or sheep, or any combination thereof, we only got ten of, uh, of each group because, well, we were waiting for the Silkies and the Suffolks and the Jerseys. Since you can't sell animals in this game, there's really no way to upgrade them other than waiting for them to die, which for chickens would probably not happen. I think starting, I think some of our chickens will start to die next year, but for cows and sheep, uh, that would be beyond the life of this playthrough. Oh, that's right, we need to actually water our crops. It's It's been a while. It's been a while since we've had to water crops, so you'll have to excuse me. Anyway. So that was, so the point is, is that uh, we kind of don't want to have to wait for our animals to die, which is why we reserved some slots for the upgraded version of those animals. Now I should point out that most recipes that use an egg or milk or cheese can use the upgraded version of that. So most recipes that use an egg can use a black egg or a golden egg. But I believe there are a couple recipes that you have to have a regular egg or a regular milk or regular butter, etc. to make. Probably not butter, but anyway. So that is something that you're going to want to keep in mind. And if you want to continue making those recipes, and we forgot the cheese, um, then it will be a good idea to have a regular chicken. Even after all of your, your uh, older chickens die off, it's a good idea to have a regular chicken. Also something to note about the upgraded versions of the animals is that if they win an animal festival, they'll produce the golden version of their product, so gold egg, gold milk, or great wool. They'll produce it more often than the regular ones. That's kind of to reflect the fact that their base product is much more valuable. And so people don't just go entering in their base animals and never Silkies or Suffolks or Jerseys. Oh, and there was an there's another Wonderful that will be on sale this bazaar too. I forget what it is. I think it's the one that increases the number of slots from 6 to 12. So, you know, right now we can make six stacks of anything or six different stacks of different things. And I believe the wonderful that will be on sale this spring doubles that. So instead of, you know, say having six different seeds in the seed in the in the grinding windmill, we can instead have twelve different seeds, or you know, three stacks of wheat and and nine stacks of other stuff. If you made it this far in the video, don't forget to like it if you haven't already, to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already, and to let me know any thoughts you have down below. 
I especially appreciate that last one, but all of them really do help me out. And they help my videos show up in your inbox more consistently. So do not forget. So this, this olive tree, it's gonna need to be moved up here, right, one of these two spots, uh, because, well, it, it's a spring tree, and that's where I'm putting spring trees, is up there. Also, what is the other spring tree? I think it's coffee, and I think that's sold by Diego's Delights. I could be wrong, but I do know that there are a couple of trees that we don't have, that we haven't had access to yet. Um... But anyway, this will be an apple tree, and that will start producing fruit um, this autumn. Let's use some pet peasant fertilizer for this stuff. I also want to replace one of these trees, but I don't remember which one is muscat and which one is grape. So I'm actually going to have to look through some old videos and, and look into that. Um, do we have both muscat and grape? We do. You know what, we'll go ahead and do that right now. Because it doesn't really matter. It, it doesn't, I'm, like, I'm not too attached to having one part to, to, anyway. These will, of course, mature before, before autumn, so it's fine. We'll do grape seeds up top, and muscat seeds, whoops, muscat seeds below. Yo. And we'll also fertilize these. Another golden egg? What in the world? Yo. That's crazy. Yo. Yo. Some crazy luck we, we just got with this golden Yo. eggs. Two in a row from a regular chicken. Unbelievable. Alright, let's go and check what Enrique has before we open our stand, shall we? Oh, and let's check for uh, cabbage, I believe it is. Uh, are you serious? No cabbage. Unbelievable. Alright. Um, I think that actually might be the cat that we're looking for. I should have checked. So he's got baby jerseys, baby, baby Suffolks, and he's got baby silkies. Cool. So we'll be able to get all three. And remember, we're only buying the baby versions. We are not buying adults. Not with how long it's taken the Tau Trio to get to 10 hearts or five I didn't, stars. I didn't do the build up to, uh, to how much this pink brooch is worth, but 128,000 for Three stars. That's, by the way, that's double the price of a half star, so I mentioned that. But anyway, yeah, so we are actually going to do quite well this bazaar, even though, well, we're not going, we don't really have a whole lot to sell. Not a whole lot of our five star produce. Eat fruit yogurt. I, I'm so hungry, I can barely move. I think I'm going to pass out. Take one of my items. I'm so happy to help. <laughs> really? Then I'll take one of these or butter. Thank you. I'll sell it and buy. You could just eat it. You could just eat it. I know this guy from Mineral Town. Uh, what is his name? Yuto. Yeah, he just he, he eats but he eats a plate of butter for breakfast most mornings. So there we go. At the same time, no less. Unbelievable. Okay. So now we have blown past the goal, and I'm pretty sure we're guaranteed first place right now. It's good because we aren't having a lot of people coming by wanting stuff for free. Eggs! Scrap metal! Oh, my glasses! I can't find my glasses! They're on your head. What? Oh, you're right. Thank you. I didn't notice them at all. I've said it before, but anybody that's ever had glasses can relate to that. 220,880. Yeah, we've met the goal. Yeah, that's... That's an understatement. Well, Lloyd's got some silver, so definitely want to pick some of that up. I'm thinking maybe at least 20. I just... 
just spent 250,000 G at his store, and he's like, Ugh, gosh, really? You're not gonna buy more? Excuse you. Uh, tempura udon. Definitely want to get some of that. That'll be 1,200 D. Thanks. I'll throw in the recipe for you too. I'm still annoyed that Roll is not selling cabbage seeds. Ay, ay, ay. All right, let's see what's what's in stock here. Oh, chili peppers are a thing. Um, well, anyway, soy flour and summer sun. Nothing that we need. Uh, obviously, Diego's stock is kind of random, so yeah. Oh, and uh, anyway, uh, no, I. It's. Let me see. Do we have? Yeah, we have a toy flower. Amiko, as we've just seen, likes toy flowers, so... Um... Would she like blue? Probably. So, Amiko's birthday is tomorrow. And so we'll be giving this to her for her birthday. I'm pretty sure that's the only birthday coming up this week. I'm pretty sure Sherry's is not for almost two weeks. Hello there, welcome to the Super Lucky Lotto. Would you like to play? Which coins would you like to use? I think we can only play twice and with the bronze coins. Okay then, let's see just how lucky you are. Fifth prize, maybe you'll be luckier next time. Well, I mean... It's not bad. It's not a bad prize. Hello there. Welcome to Super Lucky Lotto. Would you like to play? Which coins would you like to use? See how lucky you are. Unfortunate. Speaking of scrap metal. Alright. Welcome to Lucky Lotto. Care to play? One ticket is 300G. Okay. Number one. Third place prize. Bottled walnuts. That ain't bad. And then... Nothing. I have to rely on my luck when I play. Yes, I am fully aware of that. And another nothing. Just keep frickin'. Yep, third brick. Hey! Third place prize, bottled chestnuts this time. Well, certainly better than nothing. Welcome, welcome. Would you like your fortune red? It's just 100G. Sure, tell me my fortune. Abracadabra, what fate lies in wait for you? Your lucky color is red. Being active will bring you fortune. So, did that enlighten you at all? Feel free to come back anytime. You know, that's not... Yeah, I can't remember if I wanted to do... Because this does look like a little yellow, but you know what? We'll go for it. Okay, so this is the... This is this cat will be named... Treetop. There's a... There was a poker player. Very, very, uh... Skilled, very famous. He was... Anyway, he was known as Treetop. That was... That was his nickname. And, uh... I had a cat that I named t Treetop. An orange, uh, an orange cat, so anyway. Let's go with the... Uh, let's start with the Jersey cows. Hold on, you don't have enough troughs to feed them. But I can ask the carpenter to build you another trough. That'll be 60,000 in total. Oh, it's a lot more expensive than I remember, but we've got enough. So, Dialga for this one. Yes, Dialga is okay. Yes. What do you want to name him? This one is, of course, Palkia. Yes. And, of course, uh, 
Gira hold on. Giratina would not fit for this one, so we're just gonna call it Girtin. Right, that's how I want to do it? Yeah, okay, so this is Girtin. Because Giratina wouldn't fit. I guess Girtin. Alright, and then. Is that. Wasn't there a. Oh, there is the Silky. <laughs> the Suffolk, rather. So the Suffolk sheep. Yes. This is going to be Esp. Technically, Espion would fit. But. You know, we're, we're going to go. Go ahead and leave the Eon implied. So that's Espeon. Thanks. Take good care of him. And then the last... I think there's just one. Oh, I thought silky chickens were 3500 Were the same price as uh, regular chicks, but I guess not. And then for the silky chicken, this one is going to be... Ray... Alright, well, that is... that's a lot. That's a lot. I see. Well, I hope you come back soon. Oh my goodness. Year 3 also, in case you didn't notice, is when the other colors of pets become available. And so if you want those pets, then you better... Then you better... In time. You better save some space for them. Because pets you can't sell and they can also never die. Strawberry pie? Sure, why not? What in the world is that in the middle, though? This is what I want to know. Munier. Fish filet seasoned heavily with salt and pepper. Alright. Thank you. I'll teach you the recipe as well. Now I don't think Cafe LA is where we get is we we get that from Jones Cafe. Oh, cappuccino. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some strawberry pie for everyone, shall we? All right, and some menu menuere. Oh goodness, for everyone. Here you go. I hope you enjoy it. And lastly, please come back later then. Um, sandwich, probably not a winner. We're gonna go with some tempura udon. And we're gonna go ahead and buy 20, 21, even though I know that Freya wouldn't like this. I'm still gonna give her some anyway. We already tried miso soup, miso soup, and I don't think we've tried fish stew yet. So, we've got a lot of gifts to give to everybody. What should we start with? Uh, I guess we'll start with strawberry pie. Imagine anyone not liking tempura. <laughs> Yo, how are you doing? Well, thank you very much. Bonbon, oh, and then let's get cherry pie. Ran, kaketan, you've got sensation. Good afternoon, Ray. You look well. A present to thank you. <laughs> Ori, how it's work going? Boy, I love strawberry pie. This looks great. Thank you. Okay, so apparently strawberry pie is Daisy's favorite dish, but it's not a is not a liked dish by from many. Like there are lots that really don't like it. And I don't understand why. So there there you go. But we already have Daisy at max friendship, so we don't really need to be whoops. 
We don't really need to be trying to get her any higher. So we don't need to be giving her strawberry pies every day. So 370 for that and 460 for this, for the bottled walnuts. Together that's uh, 830. So just barely more than half of what we spent on those tickets. Oh wait, actually, sorry. Forgot about the scrap metal. Walnuts, chestnuts, light blue brooch, fluorite brooch. In the future, uh, when we give Daisy a gift for her birthday, something we can do... Oh. Let's try giving Strawberry Pie to Freya. Mm -hmm. I'm in a good mood today. Thank you. This is nice. So when we give uh, Daisy gifts for her birthday, we can go ahead and... We can set some strawberries aside, and that way we can go ahead and give her her favorite gift for her birthday because it should be a recipe that we can make on our own. Hello there, how is work? Me, it's going quite well. It's been busy though. Thank you, how thoughtful. But now we know. What? Oh, it's you. Are you just wandering around? You must be pretty bored. For me? Wow, not bad, thanks. And now we can also exclude Daisy from the list of villagers that we need to give gifts to, give cafe recipe gifts to, whatever, you know what I mean. Um, and then we already gave that to Ivan, he didn't like it. Hey Turk, hey, hey Ray. <laughs> what are you up to, taking a break from work? Oh, for me? Thanks. Hey Ray, you like bird. Yes, this is me, thanks. And then I think it's just the twins and then Hello. For me? Th thank you very much. Hey there, what are you doing? Ray, shouldn't you be, like, working? Thanks. I'm impressed that you know what I like. Yo. And that last one is for us. Alright. So yes, from now on we only need to give out 20 gifts. Or, uh, 19 in the fall. Uh, so... Uh, because now that- so, like, that's the thing, is that, like, for the reason why we don't give Stuart a gift, which, by the way, we should actually talk to him, at least, because we didn't do that. Uh, the reason why we don't give Stuart a gift, or, uh, um, or Sherry a, a gift, you know, like, all that kind of stuff, is because we already know their favorite thing. And so... How are y'all sales this time? Oh, is the bazaar over already? Actually, yes. It just ended. But I sold all of our stuff before then. Anyway, um, so yeah, because we already know what various people like, we don't really need to be giving them any gifts uh, to find out what their favorite thing is, because, well, like I said, we already know it. I guess we might as well go ahead and plant something here. Uh, Potatoes should be done by the next bazaar, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. And, uh, oh, that's right, we need the hoe. So yeah, uh, Raul not carrying the cabbage seeds day is uh, a little unfortunate and I don't know if he even can carry them this week now or this this year now um, I'm pretty sure starting in year four his stock is no longer random and so he'll he'll have all of his all of the seeds but it kind of sucks for us to not be able to get cabbage growing this year if if it is the case that he 
won't be able to stock it until next year. We forgot to pick up oil! Oh my gosh! Oh no! Chen was selling oil this week and we forgot to grab some. Well, I forgot to grab some, not putting this on you. Good morning, Ray. Are you awake yet? I brought your animal order over. Thanks for your business. See you at the bazaar. Great! Looks like everybody is here! It's time to announce the bazaar results! Our top three earners in third place with 132,000 G! June, congratulations! In second place with 168,000 G! Sherry Store, congratulations! And in first place with 270,110G! Ray, congratulations! <laughs> Next time, I'll be number one. Just wait. And the person with the happiest customers was... Sherry, the customer said your service was top-notch! But of course... What else would you expect? You will the a down proud. Keep up the good work. For being in the top three, Ray will receive a token of thanks. A coffee beans. I hope you like it. Oh, nice. Uh, oof. For our goal to be the best bazaar in the world, we made it a little past halfway. That's not bad, but we'll need to do a lot better next time to meet the goal. Our goal for the next bazaar is 150,000 to 200,000 G. We can do it. Well, that's all for now. Start getting ready for the next bazaar. Oh my goodness. Uh, so the thing is, we could get these coffee beans processed into a into coffee tree seeds. Whoops. And I think we're gonna wanna try and do that. Just to be on the safe side, because there's no telling when uh, Diego will be selling coffee bean, uh, coffee bean seed, tree seeds, yeah, at his store. And just to be safe, yeah. So, which, by the way, uh, no, wait, hold on. Yeah, I think you can only get them here three or later. I could be wrong. I don't know. Anyway, but we're just gonna we're we're gonna start the process right now, and I don't know how long it's going to take, because on the one hand, tree seeds tend to take quite a while. On the other hand, we do have a blue wonderful installed. It is a it is a two win day, so maybe it'll be done sooner than I think. Ninety-six hours, which is uh, four days, so that's not too bad, actually. I guess we should have been aiming to not win on reputation, because usually with the seventy-five percent bazaar, you know, winning on reputation is perfectly fine. It, it, you know, you don't—it's not a bad thing. But I guess if you... Ray, I'm coming in. What is this? Oh. Oh, well done! You got five cats! I'm sure they'll make your farm a lively place. Oh, 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 take good care of them. What? What was that? And our cats should be able to take care of all the chickens, and our dogs should have no trouble at all taking care of all of the cows and sheep. And so here's, by the way, the second feeding bin. So you put... You put two pieces of fodder in here, and you put two pieces of fodder in here. Also, the Suffolk sheep, I think we are going to want to brush. Just because that way, it might be at a high enough heart level for... For the witch... Excuse me. It might be at a... Oh, thank you. Um, for the sheep festival later this year. We might be able to get that up, get our Suffolk sheep up to enough hearts that we can go ahead and enter in 
or Suffolk rather than one of our regular sheep, but I guess we'll have to see. Good morning. Are many people out this early? What is inside? Oh, in honor of my birth. Thank you. Mm, you are a strange person. I've never met anyone as interesting as you. Um, have you met anyone ever? Hey there, what are you doing? Ree, shouldn't you be, like, working? Thanks. I'm impressed that you know what I like. You like food, apparently. Um, hello. For me, th thank you very much. Like, it's not that hard. Apparently any food, and likes it. Oh, Ree, how's it going? So we're not going to be giving Daisy any fish stew now that we know what her favorite gift is. So. We will give her a strawberry pie on her birthday. Provided that we actually can make it, like it's not too difficult to make it. Um, but other than that, we don't really need to be giving her any more gifts. Is this a joke, Ray? This stinks! Yeah, you could even say that it stinks like fish. Something I've been wondering recently is whether or not your animals spending time outside counts as not ignoring them. Because if you ignore your animals for two days in a row, you'll lose friendship points with them. And I'm wondering if them going outside, if like the dogs and the cats taking them outside, or maybe milking or sh and cheering them, who knows, um, counts as not ignoring them. Well, five of the upgraded animals, plus uh, let's not forget about our new cat, Treetop, uh, that's not really a bad haul at all for our first bazaar of the of year three, and not to mention, I mean, the money we made was also not a bad haul. But I think we're gonna have to call it here for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you later, and I hope the rest of your day is a good one. Bye.